Have you ever been told that you can't achieve something just because you're a woman? When I had like six years old, I wanted to be like a car race pilot. And I told to my cousins and my friends. And they start to love and they tell me that I can't be a car race pilot because I'm so little or I don't have the necessary money. But the biggest offense that I received was you can't be a car race pilot because you're a woman. I started to think and I told to myself, I can't achieve my dreams just because I am a woman. Now, let's focus on the past. A few years ago, the woman can vote, couldn't use jeans, couldn't drive a car. But why? The reason is that people think that the women are weak and they think that we can do only the homeworks. I ask you to think on your moms, sisters, girlfriends, or some woman important to you. Now, think that woman have a big dream. Like being president or something like that. Now, think that a person supposed to meet her for the simple fact of being one. But why we need to live with that comments? Why this need to continue like that? A lot of women do incredible things like any laundry, the first woman on going around the world on bicycle, or Dorothy Garrett, the first their geologist of discovered the keys of the human evolution. But what does women have in common? The what they have in common is that they fought against adversity for achieve her dreams and they show us that the women are fighters and we can do everything we want and I know that the world is not ready to receive a woman on the car race. But I'm going to say to the world, I will, I'm ready to drive a car in a race. Okay. Repeating the words of Bertha Bits, the first woman who made the longest route with the first prototype of a car. Don't let that anyone or anything Keep you away of your dreams. Thank you.